All eyes are on Georgia for tomorrow's special runoff elections. The vote outcome is something that could shift the balance of power in the U.S. Senate. On your side's Ken Amara spoke with those trying to get the vote out in southeast Georgia. He has more for us now. In the Peach State of Georgia, there's a fight for every vote in all 159 counties. Glynn County in southeast Georgia has been the focus of the candidates. Saturday, we had a visit from um, Raphael Warnock, and the attendance was electrifying, seriously. Dr. John Perry heads the NAACP chapter in Brunswick. Perry says he is among those working to get the vote out. The amount of diversity that was represented in the attendance um, was absolutely refreshing. Dr. Ginny Hall with the Glynn County GOP says Senator Kelly Leffler recently visited Brunswick, also trying to get the vote out. Hall tells On Your Side by phone, we're excited and working to ensure the integrity of the elections. We have poll watchers and we're working with the Board of Elections. We want to keep Glynn County red. Just how important is this Georgia runoff elections? Very. The results can shift the power in the United States Senate. Tuesday voter turnout could be heavy. We're doing everything that we can to urge citizens to get out to vote. And we've done it from a nonpartisan standpoint, just encouraging people to get out, let your voice be heard. Um, this vote matters. And so we're expecting that we're going to have a great turnout. Uh, we're looking for long lines. And we're hoping that people come in, come in droves. Ken Amaro, First Coast News, on your side. And we want to remind you that tomorrow the polls will be open from 7 a.m. until 7 p.m. across Georgia. As long as you're in line by 7 p.m., you will be able to vote. And tomorrow night, count on us for the latest results as they come in and live coverage from Georgia starting on First Coast News at 5. We will be providing short updates during primetime, but we will limit any disruptions to your favorite shows.